Somebody said, my four and a half year old girl, all the girls are teasing her because she's very dark and the rest of the girls are lighter skin. Oh so she God. doesn't want to go to school anymore. Mother is just as important. But this is part of patriarchy where we only have father's name. Why can't there be more female editors? Why are there so few female sound designers? So single parenting ke bahut sawal to uthte hi hain. Pehle to single parenting, achha you separated. What happened? You know, I'm, he seems like a nice guy. If you come from a caste which is looked down upon, where you've been discriminated, can that person ever say, I don't care about caste? No. For some reason, after 26 years, I have to still explain that, bhai, this is a choice. Yeah. I don't question your choices. Ko question nahi karti hu. Aap din raat, kyu meri choice ko question karte ho? Hi everyone, this is Avinash Lohana and you're watching Pink Villa. You know there are days when you do not have enough words to describe your guest purely because I believe she's beyond any definition, stereotypes or norms. Please welcome Nandita Das. Thanks, Hi Avinash. Nandita. <laughs> Firstly, thank you for doing this. I know you do not do many interviews and I know you're doing this for me. So thank you Absolutely. so much. It means the world to me. <laughs> no, you, we have had many interactions yes. and you know you have not misquoted me. <laughs> and uh, which sometimes happens. Yeah. So, and you've always cared about what I do, which not too many people probably do. So, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you so <laughs> much. I want to start this interaction with a very, very simple question. Nandita, you're beyond an artist. Why do you act and direct? Yeah, that's a question I often ask myself. I don't know if I'm a true artist. Actually, I'm not really an artist and I'm saying it genuinely. Um, for me, art is more a means to an end. You know, I like to share, I like to communicate, I feel strongly about things, I, um, things disturb me, what is happening all around us. So I think that is what kind of motivates me to want to tell it. And then I find interesting means. So it could be writing a column, it could be acting, it could be directing, it could be writing a script, whatever it is. Then So that becomes just the means. But the means are important because if you don't tell it right, Whatever you want to tell is not going to reach. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, I mean, I think I, I also believe that stories are powerful. Yeah. You know, we get moved by stories. Stories challenge our prejudices. Stories engage us. You know, stories excite us. So, stories are important. So, as an actor, you can enter different stories. As a director, you can tell your own story. Yeah. But in an industry which drives so much on commerce, glitz and glam, uh, <laughs> is it a tough choice to make? And when you made this choice years ago, what challenges you came across? So, you know, I stumbled upon acting. I never wanted to be an actor. It was neither an ambition nor a dream. And we must have talked about this also at some point earlier. So, um, I, was, I did my master's in social work and then I was engaged with some NGOs working on issues of women, children, education, etc. And then I did FIRE, which uh, created a lot of you know, controversy but a lot of interesting conversation not just around uh, you know what we call now LGBTQ issues yeah. that time the key word tha, homosexuality and heterosexuality yeah. uh, we didn't even have the vocabulary but it also talked about freedom of expression and various things and then I started getting more roles I did Hazar Chaura Ki Maa with Govind Helani yes. then I did Deepa's Earth etc and I started also getting more mainstream offers and what was mainstream for me and hatke for them, like films like Ax and Pita, I did those films and I realized that this industry is not for me. Yeah. And this is not, I'm honestly not sort of judging the industry as such, but just the fact that it is deeply hierarchical. And you know, my social work experience was all about breaking hierarchies. Yeah. It's all about democratizing things. Yeah. At that time, maybe it was more hierarchical than it's now. Also, everyone thought it's about song and dance. That is least of the problem because I did Odyssey for 12 years. In fact, yes. I love dancing. Yeah. And, uh, you know, but, but I just felt that this kind of a cinema that almost, uh, I don't know how to say, but finds uh, more realistic cinema almost as a bit of a pain. That, you know, people want to escape. Yeah. They have enough of a drudgery in their lives and people want, and that kind of cinema I didn't connect with. Maybe because I didn't grow up watching films, my parents never took me to, you know, film, to watch film. That wasn't their form of wow. entertainment. That's why I didn't make So, it's just something that I, so I never really was part of the industry. Yeah. I've always remained on the periphery of it. 
and uh, willfully and that's why I have a strange relationship with the industry. वो भी मुझे अपना नहीं समझते पूरी तरह से यू नो आई आई गो टू पैनल्स वेन देर इज समथिंग अबाउट सोशल वट एवर सम सोशल इशू और इफ इट्स दे ऑलवेज थिंक ऑफ मी एज शी मेक्स दीज काइंड ऑफ फिल्म दैट मे बी नॉट टू मेनी पीपल वॉच एंड सो आई डोट नो इट्स इट्स अ स्ट्रेंज काइंड ऑफ अ रिलेशनशिप बट आई एम एट पीस विथ इट नाउ यू रिमेंबर द फर्स्ट फिल्म दैट यू सॉ आई ओनली रिमेंबर वन फिल्म हाथी मेरे साथी विच आई सॉ इन थिएटर्स दैज यू ओनली फिल्म आई थिंक माई पेरेंट्स टुक मी टू इन अ थिएटर बट एवरी टाइम आई टू कम टू माई नाना नानी इज टू बॉम्बे दैट टाइम इट वॉज बॉम्बे आई यूज टू वॉच फिल्म ऑन द टी वी और हमारे घर में तो टी वी भी नहीं था तब इनफैक्ट आज भी मेरे घर में नहीं है पर मेरे घर में लाइक इन माई ग्रोइंग अप ईयर्स ऑलमोस्ट आठ साल बाद आया जब सबके घर में टी वी भी होता था दैट टाइम यू नो वी डेंट हैव इट बट गोइंग टू माई नाना नानी इज आर वॉचिंग दो फिल्म एवरी संडे और वॉचिंग छाया गीत वॉज दिस बिग थिंग दैट टाइम द फिल्म वर डिफरेंट यू नो या कॉमन पर्सन वॉज द प्रोटेगनिस्ट ऑफ द फिल्म सो इट वॉज अ स्टोरी ऑफ अ रिक्शा वाला और अ मिल वर्कर और अ रेगुलर मिडिल क्लास पर्सन The stories were fairly. I mean, they weren't really so much about art and commercial. Yeah. They were films. They had song and dance. They had romance. They had things that you know were connected to society. Yeah. So I and in fact, my introduction to cinema happened in college, mm. and all my friends wanted to become filmmakers and stuff like that. So they introduced me directly to more independent cinema, more world cinema. So somehow I just skipped this education of Bollywood. which i think pretty much everybody goes through yeah you know so i somehow mai reh gayi us uh, exposure se at that young age when you did fire uh, a lot of people would have come and said mat karo ye ek image banayega stereotype <laughs> karega ye hua nahi par tab to pata bhi nahi tha ki koi second film hogi i mean i didn't do it to become an actor i just thought it was an interesting story so i acted wow. in it you know so i didn't know iske baad mai dusri film bhi karne wali hu so Achha. there was no image this that uske baad panch che film mein karne ke baad every time like every offer i would get they would say you know this will change your image hmm. we have this as fashion designer who's going to do your clothes or you know you will be the head of a you know fashion magazine editor or i would get the other extreme where it was like the social activist who's going to change the world so i had these two kind of things and neither of them were very interesting for me yeah. you know i just wanted interesting stories about human relationships where you could play different things and uh, then that's when i started thinking that i'll do regional films because at that time they Correct. were you know they were working from a smaller pond yeah so it was more um, they were more pure in their i think convictions their honesty yeah. whatever story they wanted to say it they were doing less compromises correct to wo karne mein zyada maza aaya but that time there was no ott to log meri jo malayalam film hai ya bengali film hai ya kannada film hai ya you know tamil film hai nahi dekh paaye i mean had i done some of those those films today maybe the rest of the country also or yeah. would have watched it more yeah but having said that those experiences were precious and you know they have helped me to be the person i am and yeah. so there are no regrets of that at all No, Nandita. It has. Uh, I must tell you, it has had such a long-lasting impact on people like me also. Some of your films have been educating for us. It has mm-hmm. made the kind of people also we are today. So thank you for doing those oh, steps when at like that you. time nobody was doing, and <laughs> so less you. people were doing. Thank you. As a director, uh, you said you were in the shackles of stereotype at one point. But as a director, do you take very strong or conscious efforts to not cast actors who have done those parts before? Well um I mean casting is a very important thing right mm. you want someone who looks the part immediately there is no time to build it unless yeah. it's a very big role and if that is the part of the intention mm. that you don't want that person to look like that part and then gradually yeah. for instance in zigato mm. you know like everybody was surprised that i cast kapil sharma correct right so they were like I how did you i'm like that's yeah. the first question they asked me yeah the first is uh, why kapil sharma yeah. the second is why i shot in bhuvneshwar like who knows that you may not even know that i shot it there yeah. so i'm just sharing that so i think there is something interesting that is surprising about because we've seen kapil in a certain kind of a character yeah. so of course there is something surprising but also he looks the part that is hmm. the first thing you have to look the part but his image as a comic personality is too large 
डिड दैट प्ले हिंदी इन सम पॉइंट क्योंकि कई बार जो ऑडियंस है वो इमेज पे प्ले करती है देखिए इमेज तो आपकी बनती है आप कुछ भी करो hmm. आपका एक परसेप्शन बनेगा जी राइट दैट परसेप्शन इज बेस्ड ऑन वट एवर लिटिल यू नो इफ समन लाइक मी हुज बिन ऑन द पेरीफ्री ऑफ द इंडस्ट्री फॉर ट्वेंटी सिक्स ईयर्स नाउ बट हैजेंट हैड अ पी आर दैट मीन्स यू आर नॉट बींग पुश समी हु डजेंट लाइक टू डू इंटरव्यूज इफ यू आर नॉट आउट देर यू डोंट नो मी so Absolutely. whatever little you know me a little more yeah. but most people don't know yeah. who I am so they form a perception which yeah. is what we do for most people Correct. we meet somebody hum unke kapdon se perception bana lete hain unke words ya thoughts se perception bana lete hain we just get to know a sliver of their life correct right like people sometimes when they meet me they're like oh you're so funny so i'm like why doesn't it come out i'm like people <laughs> ask me serious questions i'm not yeah. going to trivialize that i'll answer seriously yeah. you say something funny i'm not trying to be funny correct you know like correct. if it's yeah. but i also have a funny bone in my body which Absolutely. will come out in different ways when yeah. it has to yeah. right so i think if you don't take yourself too seriously and you're not building an image yeah. you will have an image correct sometimes you're trapped in that image sometimes it irritates you also yeah. kare yaar please don't you know like sometimes journalists young journalists they come to me they say ma'am i was so nervous i thought i don't know if i ask will i make a mistake this that but you're so normal so i'm like i don't know what you came with like <laughs> why did you come with this howa thing that i'm yeah. going to be this you know like difficult person or this yeah. annoying person or yeah. i don't know whatever perception they had or like you know sometimes people say so what are the books you've read in this last year and i say i've not read a single book साड़ी <laughs> 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 to events like why can't she wear something modern you like still get this of course like even designers would say you know something modern why don't you wear a gown i think it look great on you why don't you do this kind of a film i think you'll really do it they feel that maybe it's sour grapes or maybe she wants to but she's hesitating for some reason after 26 years i have to still explain that bhai This is a choice. मैं yeah. आपकी choices को question नहीं करती हूँ आप दिन रात क्यों मेरी choice को question करते हो I just think we put too many blinkers, too yeah. many labels, too yeah. many boxes, and therefore we don't even allow ourselves to kind of, you know, be open to surprises. Yeah, yeah, true, absolutely. Um, I have always noticed, Nandita, you have a lot of empathy. Um, where does this stem from? I think human beings are basically empathetic, aren't they? I mean, children, एक बच्चे को वो देखता है कि किसी कुत्ते को रास्ते में एक गाड़ी जाती है वो ऐसे हो जाता है वो एकदम से रुक जाता है यू नो ग्रोन अप को जल्दी है तो वो चला जाएगा या यू सी सम वुमेन सिटिंग अलोन एंड यू नो ईटिंग वट एवर लेफ्ट ओवर यू सी अ रैक पिक यू सी अ चाइल्ड विल लुक एट दैट मच मोर और पर्सन यू नो वी हैव बिकम selfish we've become individualistic we all are in some kind of a rat race we are you know in competition and varies between 1 to 10 hum log kahi to hain hmm in the game of life ji to uski wajah se kya hota hai ki hamari empathy dheere dheere kam hone lagti hai not because we are not empathetic people hmm. we basically are humko abhi bahut aise karna padta hai kisi ko thoda zyada karna padta hai kisi ko kam karna padta hai that's why our films are very dramatic Yeah. for me to make you feel maybe i have to do like lot more yeah. look this person's really suffering she's yeah. crying bleeding tab to kuch feel karo correct you know choti choti jaise zigato mein there are small acts of indignations you know the loss of small losses of dignity yeah. so if you are sensitive to that you will feel them you will feel them acutely yeah or if you are not sensitive to them you will be like ye yaar ye to sabke sath hota hai abhi kaun si badi baat hai yeah you know the so it will vary yeah so i just think that empathy is the crux of being human hmm. in some sense right hmm. and sadly nobody teaches us hamare education mein nahi hai ye correct hamare education mein science hai maths hai english hai ye sab hai ek class honi chahiye na ki bhaiya ye tumhare mein abhi hai par isko main consciously main padha rahe hain taki tum puri zindagi ye tumhara base ban jaye ji so uh, i think it's very important and we all lose it we all sometimes i get very irritated about something and i i judge i get angry i i mean all human we're emotions humans. we are 
part of it but how quickly do we come back how quickly do we bring it back and say hey no that was not right yeah. you know i need to understand yeah and also i think we don't spend enough time with each other right like if i get to know you a little deeper when i judge you but after that if i hear your story i'll say oh acha avinash is like this because of this yeah automatically it will trigger my empathy yeah so i think if we engage more yeah if we uh, allow people to tell their stories and we listen to them a little more yeah you know we go beyond what we see we will automatically be empathetic because yeah. i think basically we are as human beings we are supposed to be empathetic ab dimag hai itna sara to uska istemal bhi karna chahiye na but nahi to aise wo bhooke bacche ko dekhna important nahi hai uske bare mein kuch karna bhi zaruri hai tab empathy ko execution diya jata hai pehle to dekhe par pehle to dekhe hum to dekhte bhi nahi hai hum to itne numb ho chuke hain hum har roz dekhte hain you know मतलब मैं मुझे याद है आई आई टू राइट अ कॉलम फॉर द वीक कॉल द लास्ट वर्ड एंड इन वन आई हैड रिटन दैट व्हेन व्हेन आई वाज प्रेग्नेंट एंड माय चाइल्ड वाज गेटिंग यू नो वाज गोइंग टू कम आउट इन अ फ्यू मंथ्स एंड आई वाज थिंकिंग गॉड हाउ विल आई रेज हिम द वर्ल्ड इज सच अ क्रेजी प्लेस ही इज गोइंग टू आस्क मी ऑल दीस डिफिकल्ट क्वेश्चंस थिंग्स दैट वी हैव ऑल नॉर्मलाइज्ड आई वाज लाइक रियली स्ट्रेसिंग अबाउट इट यू नो कट टू फ्यू इयर्स एज ही इज गोइंग अप ही वाज टू देन ही वाज थ्री आई रिमेंबर अ सीन वेयर ही वुड लुक आउट ऑफ द विंडो बिकॉज़ वी face the sea we yes. used to stay in worli at that time and he was just looking and i was, went to him and said what is happening why are you looking for me mama they are doing potty on the rocks so i was like yeah because they don't have in their houses you know there are no bath he couldn't understand they had no bathroom and he was like oh but we have three bathrooms why can't they come and do it here and Amazing. i was like i said you are right i mean it's really sad and we started talking about you know unfortunately there's so much disparity and those questions that kept saying and then as he grew up when he became 10 and 11 now he's 12 <clears throat> he looks at them you know the people on the street or whatever those disparities and i can see that it still bothers him but now he's slowly normalizing it mm. and which is tragic it is to see that my god he's going to be like one of us <laughs> you know and that is that is the dehumanizing process that we all go through yeah and and that's why the next step that you said we have to do something about it yeah so when i work a lot or if i go and i'm talking about something in college or you know so or i'm writing and he says mama you're not with me so i tell him i said you know what i'm doing you should know what i'm doing i'm doing this i don't know whether it will help but i'm trying because you know being in the film sometimes people call me to speak so i take him to my talks also yeah you know and he hears it and It's tough. I mean, there's again no right answer. Yeah. But I feel when you be, you start leading an, an actor or a film person's life, we yeah. were talking about it before we formally started getting yes. into it. You start, you know, in trying to protect yourself, you start living in a glass house. Yeah. Your interactions with the real world keep decreasing. Yeah. Right. And when it decreases, they become less part of your world because you're not interacting. Your interaction with your help yeah your you know whatever the lift man or the watchman waha tak simit reh jati hai yeah usme bhi log bulate hai watchman ana you know wo tailor ko de do master ji we stop even knowing their names correct so the dehumanization process is, that's why when we were talking that you know you asking what keeps you grounded is just interaction with the real world yeah. and i spend you know 90% in that world yeah and that 10% that i spend in this i can see sometimes it builds in a unnecessary anxiety or irritation <laughs> but um, but yeah but having said that there are many people in the industry i'm sure they find their own ways to be grounded yeah. and they have their childhood friends yeah. you know who put them in their place or yeah. whatever yeah. you know yeah. who yeah. remind them ki bhaiya ye tumhara kaam hai ha. usko aaj ho tum humse bahut bade bade log aake chale gaye unko koi yaad nahi karta hai well i hope so i mean that's what true friends are about if yeah. you just keep psycho fans yeah. around you then you know your life is going to be like yeah. that yeah. so <laughs> As a mother, do you consciously put in these thoughts in his head? Absolutely. I mean, and does I mean, he look at you differently from other mothers <laughs> of his friends? I think he does. But you know, I mean, there are other parents. I'm not the only one. There are lots of parents. I mean, parenting is the hardest thing. I mean, yeah. next to direction, if there's something really hard, it's parenting, and you can never do it right. I'm just thinking. I'm so consciously parenting. I'm doing. 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 I'm do
they have to discover and find things on their own and you know sometimes my son you know put, i mean he's my guru he puts me in my place main kuch zyada bhashan bazi kar do to wo bol deta hai what you think you know everything and then i say no i don't which means i have oversaid you know so or sometimes he will challenge you to said that that day and now you're saying this or if i am like rude to let's say my help or something maine kuch bol diya are kya rakha hua tha he said you forgot it you know why are you telling her why are you taking this gussa on me or whatever like yeah. he will immediately call out my hypocrisy contradiction whatever that i'm doing which is not right yeah so i immediately say sir yeah i'm sorry yeah. and you know i'll say sorry to whoever like whether it's my you know help or my assistant or something like you know galtiyan to hum sab karte hain but yeah. it's just that as long as you have people who will remind you yeah. that this is not the person you want to be yeah you know and uh, yeah so that's a lifelong process yeah. <laughs> you know even subtly putting across the concept of equality just by calling him vihan das mascara <laughs> uh, especially in that credit in the short film that you did i i where he acted <laughs> i saw you you call him vihan das that's mascara that's his name i mean we've always kept that because you know the mother is just as important but this is part of patriarchy where we only have father's name yeah. i mean i hope there will be a time that there will be no surnames because in a country like ours we immediately know what's your caste what's your region you know there are too many that so baggage is so much yeah yeah ki acha aap ye hain wo hain matlab das ki wajah se sab log samajhte hain main bengali hu because unko odia ke bare mein kuch pata hi nahi odisha ke bare mein kuch pata hi nahi so they just assume i'm bengali or you know caste like i don't understand caste so much but Immediately they'll say, अच्छा इसका ये है ना वो तो इस कास्ट का है बहुत लोग बोलते हैं सो यू नो आई मीन ऑल दीज ऑल्सो इज अननेसेसरी बैगेज ऑल दिस टेक्स अवे फ्रॉम मी यू नोइंग अ पर्सन फॉर हु दे रियली आर यू नो सो होपफुली बाय द टाइम ही ग्रोज अप ये चीज़ें और कम हो जाएंगी But what I want to ask is, does the official papers allow you to write Vihan Das Mascara? Of course, it does. Absolutely. Oh wow! There is no reason that we should not like. No, everybody shouldn't. But ये awareness भी धीरे-धीरे आ रही है ना? Correct. मुझे भी नहीं पता था honestly. हाँ, तो वैसे ही जैसे पहले तो वैसे ही होता था. जी. Right? My mother is even though she separated from my father many years ago, yeah. but she is Varsha Das because at that time used to carry on with your husband's name. Yeah. By the time I got married. I, uh, you know, decided that my name is going to be. This is my identity. This is who I am. Yeah. Why would I overnight change it to another surname? Hmm. And thankfully, I didn't because yeah. I got married, separated. I definitely didn't want to keep changing. But also, it's just your identity. Just as you are Avinash Lohana till your last breath, yeah. I am Nandita Das till my last breath. Why would I want to? Why do you expect women to change? Your wife is called what? Kujbu Gajra. She is not changing herself. There you go. So you know why should women have to change? Yeah. So I think equality has to be something that you fundamentally believe in. Yeah. yeah. What is liberal thoughts? Yeah. You know like it has to so these have to these have to be your deep convictions just yeah. as you're convinced that this is my name yeah. Nandita Das is my name you beat me up 100 times I'll still say it's Nandita Das. Yeah. Your conviction for equality your conviction for equity your conviction for you know whatever these liberal ideas of compassion and all that has to be a deep conviction then you will keep finding ways to do it yeah. but what an amazing day it would be na nandita when it will only be nandita and avinash and not lohanas and the das exactly kya farak padta hai aap koi kam ho jayenge kya correct aap balki without judgment yeah aur kuch logon ke surname itne revealing hote hain ji dekhiye jaise मैं जब बड़ी हो रही थी तो यू नो मैन टू गो टू द यूएस और यूरोप और वट एवर पीपल वुड सी इज देर कास्टिज्म एंड आई वुड से या देर इज बट यू नो आई डेंट ग्रो अप विथ इट एंड आई हैज टू टेक अ लॉट ऑफ प्राइड दैट माय पेरेंट्स डेंट पुट ऑल दीज थॉट्स इन माय हेड इट्स ओनली लेटर दैट आई रियलाइज दैट बिकॉज यू कम फ्रॉम एन अपर कास्ट यू कैन से दिस दिस इज अ साइन ऑफ प्रिवलेज टू से दैट आई डोंट केयर अबाउट कास्ट इट्स एक्चुअली ऑफेंसिव टू से दैट Yeah. because it's a privilege i'm taking it for granted correct but jiski zindagi mein caste matter karta hai if you come from a caste which is looked down upon where you've been discriminated can that person ever say i don't care about caste hmm. no that person is reminded of their caste every single day that's true 
isn't it so how can they forget about it yeah so that's why i think if you and i and everybody removes the caste then the people who are sort of hammered with it every day who have to carry that burden every day yeah. to work to their you know to every space won't have to do that yeah you know before we started the interview we were talking about there are more women dops now and uh, there are more women who are taking active part in the technical crew of the the process of filmmaking but there i still believe there are as far as women directors and producers are concerned producers especially are far and beyond like zugato you are producing also not many of us really know or talk about devi karani who was one of the first uh, major producers yeah, in in amazing. our business i don't mm-hmm. think jaden bai ever produced anything jaden bai did she did yeah, but she was she also produced, very powerful uh, yeah figure. she was also yeah she, she was music composer singer producer director so yeah it's true that you know we see women in films more as actors because they have to be right in yeah. films you need women and especially for a certain quotient ko badhane ke liye but otherwise uh, peeche nahi hai jab tak there are not enough women behind the camera the representation or the kind of roles are not going to change in front yeah. of camera right yeah. so you do need more people when there is a person looking through the lens there is something called the female gaze matlab literally and metaphorically Gee. right matlab mere 40 film mein maine kiye as a film make i mean as an as an actor 40 feature films other than short dusri short films hain ye hai wo hai and 10 languages and in 10 languages and three as a director i had never worked with a female focus puller till i did zigato we got a, fe- a female fe- focus puller and i was like wow and she was amazing you know very quiet focused literally focused and i was thinking why can't women do focus pulling is yeah. this some weight lifting and even weight lifting mein there are enough women who are Gee. stronger than puny men bhi ho sakte hain right yeah. so it is such a when you are when you are a deeply patriarchal society we don't even question ab hum question karne lage ab hum sochne lage yeah actually why can't there be more female editors Why are there so few female sound designers? Yeah. Hardly any female sound designers. Yeah. Why are there not female sound recorders? You have to sit and hear. You have to record something. Why aren't they there? Yeah. But you know, young women are now joining film schools much more than men. Yeah. There are lots of assistants. So in ten years, you will see a sea change. Already between doing Firak in two thousand eight to. doing zigato in 2022 like we you started finished shooting it. yes and yeah so in these years i have already seen a change there are many more girls and women who are now also hods like in every film of mine i seek out more women yeah. it's sometimes not easy because yeah. you are in a rush there are the variety of the range you get in men is much more because yeah. ye bhi hai ye bhi hai ye bhi hai ye bhi hai yeah. to aapke paas zyada choose karne ko hai so if you want to seek out hods not just assistants you know mm. head of departments then you have to find listen do you know someone who ah oh, yeah that one do you want to try her out like okay i'll try her out yeah. of course you want merit you want Gee. good work but i'm generalizing but i do think that women because they have to come up the hard way they are actually more focused yeah. they give more having more women on set it creates a certain kind of empathy as well yeah you know it changes the whole feel of the set yeah because diversity does that correct when you have diverse opinions you have diverse lived experiences it is going to bring something new to the mix yeah so i just hope that we can hasten the process yeah change to hoga ye to pakka hai ji par aap par hum kya isko is process ko faster kar sakte hain ji so that you know so many women don't have to be just sitting on the sidelines and waiting for their turn to come yeah yeah you know i wait and uh, imagine for a day when we don't have to do these conversation which we are doing now you you're know telling me i mean i'm also tired of it like <laughs> you know in 2023 we are still having to say yeah. and we are not a minority we are not exactly. even i mean even minority rights are super important because every human being if that minority was you isn't your life important to Correct. you but we are talking about 50% yes of the population we yeah. are talking about half the population yeah ye kya ku kiya aap logo ne All of you men, कि अभी देखिए यहाँ पर मैं आप ऑडियंस को बता रही हूँ वन टू थ्री फोर देर आर फोर कैमराज बिहाइंड देम देर आर फोर मैन एंड देर ऑल लवली मैन एंड आई एम श्योर वॉन्टिंग टू चेंज द थिंग्स बट यू ऑल फाइंड 
yeah. Seriously, why don't you all find and see? Now there is a women's cinematography collective. एक कुछ है. जी. उसका नाम मैं नंबर आपको दे दूँगी. Please. तो आप उसमें बहुत सारी young women हैं and doing amazing work. Please. But they they are finding it tough to get into yeah what an industry which is still so male dominated. But I would also like to tell you, Nandita, uh, Pinkvilla is owned by a lady. Yeah, and no, my great. editor and is a lady, and a large part of our organization also has uh, female. In fact, there are more female staff than male staff also in Pink Villa. No, that's good. But you know, we also need in technical fields. Yeah. We also need in every field. Yeah. See, there are more producers. Even otherwise, you'll see there are more producers. Yeah. Actually, women producers are increasing. Yeah. Because you know, producer as a producer, you have to multitask. Mm. You have to manage funds. Mm. You are good at communication. A lot of these skills are something that women. end up just learning through life you Absolutely. know through their growing up years yeah, yeah. so um, it's just that i feel there are more in production but still less in technical fields yeah, and i, I agree. think that there is scope for getting more of those yeah, in yeah we are also <laughs> taking a lesson from this conversation what an amazing <laughs> start to a day i must tell you no, no, there's no lesson we're just sharing our you know concerns Absolutely. things that we care about yeah. and you are hearing you're not just hearing it you're listening because you care about it so yeah. it's not a reflection of what i'm saying yeah. it's because you are you know sort of noting it saying ha ye mujhe karna chahiye i'm going to convey this and i'm going to make that little difference yeah. so it is people like you who will make that difference because yeah. you know when you are in a position of privilege yeah. and as men you are as you know people with other privileges like the exposure i had or you know our class privileges we have a greater responsibility of making that change correct otherwise those who are the receivers of that inequality are always having to say ki acha 8 march hai to bhi aurton ko you know they should be taking out rallies or if it's you know correct. environment day to environmentalists should do correct. may day hai to workers ko jana chahiye kyun yeah ye to hum sab ke liye hai environment day it's going to impact you and me as well correct why aren't we out on the street yeah. you know so i think we have to stop thinking that This is my problem. This is this person's problem. Correct. You know, cancer. Just go. Who I? Who cancer? Ke liye kare. Correct. Jo, you know, like everybody, it's become like silos. Correct. These are all human problems. They impact us all. Yeah. Single parenting is is tough. I know, but I also believe the society makes it tougher by putting it constantly out there in that person who's doing it, saying, "Yar, kaise manage karoge? Yar, bahut <laughs> difficult hai. Yar, aur ek kaise hoga ye? Do you think that happened with you?" सो सिंगल पेरेंटिंग के बहुत सवाल तो उठते ही हैं हाँ. पहले तो सिंगल पेरेंटिंग अच्छा यू सेपरेटेड व्हाट हैपेंड यू नो आई एम ही सीम्स लाइक अ नाइस गाय आई एम लाइक यार टू गुड पीपल कैन आल्सो यू नो नॉट बी सो कंपैटिबल जो फ्रेंड्स के साथ जो आपके बेस्ट फ्रेंड्स थे नॉट ऑल ऑफ देम हैव स्टक अराउंड राइट वी हैव गिवन सो मच इम्पोर्टेंस टू द इंस्टीट्यूशन ऑफ मैरिज देर आर सम अमेजिंग रिलेशनशिप बट देर आर हंड्रेड्स ऑफ फासिकल रिलेशनशिप विच वी ऑल नो ऑफ right which are there because of either convenience or just the woman is not financially independent so can't get out or various yeah. or for children etc yeah so firstly there is so much of burden of that then there will be somebody who will like i remember i was walking into vihan school once and he was still four or so four or five and this mother came to me and uh, and she said oh i'm feeling so good i've resigned as the ceo of my company i was like oh what happened she like they'll get another ceo but they won't get, my child won't get another mother and you know it suddenly put that guilt in my heart i was like shit but i'm working you know I mean, he was maybe 6 or 7 i was doing manto at that time so sure. 2008 which means he was 8 so i was like sure i'm going to start my shoot aur mujhe aise bura lagne laga and uh, but you know over the years i've realized actually it is fantastic for children to see their mother work yes that is how they will respect the fact that mothers don't have to just you know take care of the house and take care of this and that they also have desires they also have dreams yeah. they are also good at so many things yeah. they also have interests they they will start seeing them as fuller people yeah you know and that's why that's when they have girlfriends and they interact with other girls they will see them as full people and not just that you are a girl so therefore these are your expectations absolutely and then i found out in stanford there was a study done where they said that if you have a daughter and if she's seeing a woman work she, you are a role model for her yeah so she will grow up with lot more confidence of doing work yeah if you have a son 
then don't worry because the son will have better relationships and interactions with other women when he grows up because he's seen a stronger woman seen a woman who's independent yeah. so actually you are doing a great service by working or doing whatever you if you if you want to be a homemaker that's fine too yeah but not big mujhe lagta hai i want to be a homemaker usme se aap you scratch the surface phir dheere dheere wo bolenge nahi actually karna to tha but you know ab wo nahi karne diya but it's okay i mean i don't mind it and then yeah. all those conversations will begin yeah so yes to answer your question single parenting is difficult because you know lot of like you are the go to person for everything pretty much and uh, you take on and especially if you are a working person and you are a woman who's grown up with guilt which is a middle name for most women <laughs> and we all struggle with it but uh, there are also lovely joys of it you know so i mean i and my son have a lovely lovely bond and we chat about so many things we travel together so <laughs> yeah so everything has duality so you know there's no perfect thing in anything there are no binaries do you also deal with guilt I do guilt like I told you know we it's just a deep conditioning that women have because from such an early time you're constantly as a daughter as a you know you just want to do best at everything ji so agar aap achhi daughter bhi banna chahte ho achhi behan bhi banna chahte ho achhi girlfriend bhi banna chahte ho achhi wife bhi achhi mother and good at your work you're just constantly you know we women say sorry i feel i think all of that but that's also it makes us more vulnerable it yeah. also vulnerability is also the seed of creativity yeah. vulnerability is also the seed of you know getting people together and democratizing processes yeah you know it when you're too confident then you can be confident about a wrong thing also yes you know you close your things they yeah. say you know khalil gibran says that in a cup you should keep it empty thoda sa jagah honi chahiye tab aap usme bhar sakte ho agar wo always filled hoga to fir aap kya bharoge yeah. so in that sense again there is duality yeah. but guilt is not a healthy emotion I agree. and and i'm working on it very consciously and yeah. i think i'm in a slightly better place than i was last year and then last year was better than <laughs> previous year <laughs> amazing i also very strongly believe that be a good human being all other roles will fall in place that is so true that yeah. is the crux of it So every work that we do is yeah. it bringing us closer to being the person we want to be yeah. or being a better human being yeah. then you are doing the right work correct you know if you say meri work ye hai aur ye life ye hai agar aapne usko bahut usme doori kar di then it's uh, i don't know i mean maybe it works for others or whatever but you are absolutely right i think that's the only journey worth being on is colorism something still that bothers you and it's a cause that you still want Absolutely. It, is it relevant also uh, in smaller towns? I think yeah. it is. No, you'll be shocked. You know, I used to think I used to talk about colorism. Idhar udhar, like women's issues. Pe kuch baat ho rahi hai. Ya college me, I remember two three times this has happened to me. A girl has raised her hand and said, "Ma'am, how come you're so confident despite being dark?" And I used to say, "Wow, you know, because I never thought of it. Because I didn't grow up with as much of that complex. Because my parents didn't put it in my head." but others like if i go to a shop of a, where there are cosmetics they will immediately bring out the tan ka cream anti tan cream ki ma'am isse tan nikal jayega abhi bhi ha to main bolti hu isi tan se paida hui isi tan mein marungi so please anything that remotely will make me white please do not <laughs> give it to me but you know it was only in 2013 this organization uh, called um, uh, women of worth yes. it's a chennai based organization i hadn't heard of them i knew nothing about them but they said will you give me give us a quote and a photograph we want to uh, talk about colorism and we want you to support it i said sure i gave it to them suddenly it got became viral and all these media from cnn to bbc to everyone this word colorism also isn't that old yes you know it's only after 2013 and suddenly became the face of that campaign yeah and i thought god i have talked about so many issues that were so much more closer to my heart ki colorism ka mujhe bana diya hai post a girl yeah. you know this is not i mean it's important but it's not a stand alone issue but after that so many young girls especially men too and women have come to me and spoken about it and i've increasingly realized what how it has you know sort of devastated their lives they have lost a sense of self their self esteem was so low in their growing up years like this girl came and told me this she said you know she said i was always very good at acting i wanted to be an actor but i knew i would never get the main role 
so I just didn't uh, sign up for the role because they would put me at the back because I was dark. Abhi recently somebody tweeted and I responded, which I seldom see uh, on social media. Somebody said, my four and a half year old girl, all the girls are teasing her because she's very dark and the rest of the girls are lighter skin. Oh so she doesn't God. want to go to school anymore. You know, it is rampant and it is again one of those caste things. Because you're a man, because you're not really dark, you have not had to go through that. One, if you were that, ask anybody who is, you know, much darker or is not man. You ask a dark girl, she'll tell you 50,000 incidents in her life, which has, you have to fight it every single day. You know, you grow up, like I grew up, even though I say that I didn't grow up, I've started realizing there were some color colors I would never wear. I've never, I used to never wear like pinks and blues. No, no, this suit will not मुझे तो हम इतने जजमेंट्स करते हैं मैं अपने भी जब जजमेंट्स पकड़ती हूं तो मुझे ऐसा लगता है अरे हां देखा पकड़ा ना यू नो लाइक यू वांट टू गिव वन टपली टू योरसेल्फ बट दैट्स व्हाई सो नाउ यू हैव टू गो एंड हैव दैट कन्वर्सेशन सो दैट योर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ दैट आल्सो मे बी विल यू विल इन योर नेक्स्ट कन्वर्सेशन यू विल से यू नो आई अंडरस्टैंड that things that we don't experience that doesn't mean it doesn't exist yeah yeah i agree i'm sorry <laughs> no you shouldn't be <laughs> you're being honest and you're sharing thank you nandita thank you for thank being you, you. Thank, thank you, you for <laughs> these amazing insightful answers it gives so much perspective to us and everybody who's watching also it's so rare to be someone like you i'm so happy i had this conversation thank you <laughs> thank so much thank you no because when i speak also i'm also listening so yeah. i'm it's kind of sometimes it's a reaffirmation of something sometimes it's a reminder that yeah i'm saying it i better be doing more of it you yeah. know so all of yeah. that so it's also good for me to have lovely conversations like this thank you so Thanks much so thank you <laughs> if you like this video please like share and subscribe to pink villa